Um, so let's get started. I plan to cover three topics today, okay, um, in which I'll be covering a refresher on the conjunctive particle. Don't worry about the word if it sounds too intimidating, okay, conjunctive particle, which is like, you know, you adding curl on the verb, okay, such as like, you know, dekh kar, bol kar, chal kar, has kar, okay, pad kar, okay, so we'll be covering use cases of, you know, adding curl to the verb, okay, um, I'll also be covering in this class, um, usage of when and then in Hindi, so in the intermediate level class, I do expect you to be able to form longer sentences and to be able to have sentences where there are some, you know, conditions when something will happen, you will do A, B and C. Okay, so when and then. And the third topic is again conditional level sentences. Okay, conditional level sentences. So I do expect you to be able to, you know, form uh, conditional level sentences. Um, so that will cover like, you know, a uh, good number of topics to be, you know, tested in the intermediate level. Okay. Um, so let's get going. Um, and as always, the classes are very interactive. So whenever you have any questions, uh, feel free to, to unmute and ask questions and, um, uh, and then, you know, share your thoughts. And that's the whole point of, you know, uh, you know, going over it. Okay. So let's get started with conjunctive particle first. So if you remember, you know, we when we were covering the these classes, our base sentence is still the same. I make roti. Okay, so this is the base sentence in the so far all the classes we have covered, which is me roti. And uh, what is the verb here to make? Uh, let me ask um, Taraji. Taraji, what is the verb here? <clears throat> Banana, banana, right? Banana. Right, right, right. So it's going to be Mai roti banati hun. Okay. Uh, very simple sentence. If this is new for some of you, I do recommend to, you know, go to the uh, our YouTube uh, channel and cover the present indefinite tense. That will tell you about how to translate basic sentences. Okay. So as you know, and as Taraji mentioned, the verb here is banana which is to make and it's ending with na but when you're, when you're using this verb in the present indefinite case you remove the na part and uh, for a you know feminine uh, or female you will put t for male it will be ta okay so for me it will be main roti banata hu for tara ji it will be main roti banati hu okay now Simple sentence, we covered it in the you know, beginner's class, but what about like, you know, uh, cases like, you know, uh, what do you do after making roti or while making roti? Okay, what if you want to say, um, uh, or what if, you know, the case is like you have a banana, which is to make, and after that you put kar. Okay, you remove na and it will be banakar. Banakar. Okay? Banakar. And let's like let's look examples of that. Okay? So examples would be uh, roti banakar khana. Okay? It's not a full sentence, but I'm just trying to give you a hint. Right? Roti banakar khana. Okay? So such as like main roti banakar khata hu. I eat after making roti. Okay. Um, let's look at some more examples. Um, such as, um, so this will be after making, after making roti. Okay. Now in this case, you are doing this activity after the first one or while the first one is being done okay so this one is happening first roti banakar uh, khana okay similarly gar jakar gar jakar aram 
करना तारा जी वॉट यू थिंक इट मीन्स घर जाकर आराम करना ओके आफ्टर गोइंग होम डू रेस्ट ओके सो डू और टेक रेस्ट आफ्टर गोइंग होम टेक रेस्ट आफ्टर गोइंग होम नाउ इफ आई डेंट गिव यू द हिंदी पार्ट इफ आई जस्ट गिव यू दिस पार्ट यू नो टेक रेस्ट आफ्टर गोइंग होम हाउ विल यू डीकंस्ट्रक्ट इट वॉट इज द वर्ड हियर आराम करना okay um now let's let's use it in some sentences so it makes sense and you can relate with it okay so example sentence would be that um i will i will go home or after going home i'll watch a movie I will watch a movie after going home. So I want all of you to take some time and try to translate it. Try to translate this in Hindi or say it in Hindi. Um, and Navneet, I know you joined for the very first time, but I do want to give you this chance to give it a try. How will you say this in Hindi? And if it's okay, if you make mistake. uh my goal is to help you uh you know figure it out so even i even if while i do not know your current level of hindi i want to give you a chance so see if you can you know attempt it still there navneet okay you can write also uh in case if you don't feel comfortable you know uh, saying it uh, Okay, please try. Okay, so I'll help you out. Okay, so let's do this part. What is the verb here? Go to go. And to go in Hindi is. Abdana. Jana. Okay. What what is to go? Jana. Jana. Okay. and uh, after going is akar uh, very good after going is so you remove na and you put kar and it becomes jana kar jakar okay jakar the verb was jana you remove the na and you put kar because it is jakar and what is home in hindi kar gar very good And so, what is gar plus after going would be gar jakar. Okay. Gar jakar. Say it again. Gar jakar. Gar jakar. Very good. Now let's do this thing. What is this part to watch? Ah. Uh, Dek. Very good. Dekna. Awesome. See, you already know. <laughs> right. Dekna. Okay. So basically, say these three things again. Gar. जाकर जाकर देखना। देखना। जाकर क्या देखना? राइट घर जाकर मूवी देखना ओके नाउ लेट्स लेट मी रेज इट अगेन हाउ डू यू से आई इन हिंदी डू यू नो दैट मैं वेरी गुड राइट सो मैं घर रेट अगेन जाकर मूवी Movie. Take now. Okay. Now 
here is the thing, here is the, here is the catch. This sentence is written in future indefinite, okay? Um, which is, you know, something that you'll be doing in the future. And the way it works in Hindi, whenever you're saying something in future indefinite, uh, you know, you'll be using a different form of the verb, okay? Unlike English, where you have will watch, in Hindi, the base verb is still the same, dek, okay? You'll okay. remove you'll remove the na and you will put unga because if you're a guy you will put unga. For example, I will say main ghar jaakar movie dekhunga. For Tara ji, she will be saying main ghar jaakar movie dekhungi. Okay. For if, if your mom is saying it, she'll be saying main ghar jaakar movie dekhungi. And if dad is saying it, he'll be saying main ghar jaakar movie dekhunga. Okay. Uh, so it may be slightly advanced for you, but don't worry. You, if you, you know, hang on, you'll be able to catch it. Uh, good job there. Okay. Um, so let's do one more, and this time I'm going to ask uh, Tisaji to help us, you know, break it down. Um, and this one will be, um, me, uh, Give me one minute, okay? Man. Okay, after uh, I'll, I'll study. Okay, so I I will study. Let me make it simple. I will study after going to school. So I'm just giving, making it a very simple one. Tisaji, you want to give it a try? Mm -hmm. Okay, break it down basically for, for everyone. Um, school, so after going to school. School Jakar is ja after going to school. Um, school Jana, um, then you remove the Na. Okay. And add the Kar. Okay. And I will study is Me. Mm -hmm. Or I. And then uh, study is Padna. Okay, so to study in Hindi is Padna. To study in Hindi is Padna. Okay. And, and then the future tense um, unga ending. Okay. Uh, I, but it's ungi. Okay. Girl. Okay. So essentially, you're saying I will study would be me Padungi. Padungi. Okay. And in between, you are saying me Padungi after going to school. Me school. Jakar Padhungi. Main school Jakar Padhungi. Okay? Um, now you can make advanced sentences as well, right? I mean, Main school Jakar, you can name the subject that you want to study. So let's try to make it a little bit advanced for everyone. Okay? And instead of Main, let's try to put um, a different pronoun. Let's say they. Okay, they will study. Um, what's your favorite subject, Tisaji? Languages. Languages, okay. <laughs> <laughs> Let's say languages, okay. Okay, so they will study languages after going to school. They. They school. Jakar. Mm -hmm. Okay. Okay. So for they in Hindi, as you know, is way. So I is me, they is way. Way school jakar. And languages, either you can say languages itself or you can say bhashai. Bhashai. So singular is bhasha, which is language. Plural is bhashai. Way school jakar bhashai. It's a nasal like sound. Bhashai. Bhashai. Pad and Ending is enge. We school jakar bhashaye padhenge. Okay. Um, awesome. So let's get going. Um, now I want you to, without me giving you an English sentence, I want you to think about something where you're using kar. Okay. Something that applies to you, not to anyone else. Okay. 
an activity that you do after finishing the first activity and you tell me at least one sentence where you're using kar after the verb and you, you tell me the sentence okay um, it may be hard but at least give it a try okay and i want the same exercise you know if you're watching live on facebook i want you to do that as well and carolina you just mentioned as well mai school ja kar padhungi awesome um school ja kar padhna shireen also mentioned the same thing um awesome so good participation on the on the facebook as well i'm really excited um so let's see let's start with uh, uh, tara ji first because she is a bit advanced so she will help out us कहा जाऊंगी काम पे जाऊंगी ओके ऑसम सो शी से ओके सो शी से मैं तैयार होकर दिस अ गुड वन राइट सो मैं तैयार होकर ओके वर्क पे जाऊंगी और लेट मी मेक इट सिंपल ऑफिस जाऊंगी मैं तैयार होकर ऑफिस जाऊंगी व्हाट डू यू थिंक इट मींस तिसा जी तैयार होना to be ready to be ready or to get ready yeah right and so, what is it what does it mean when you say taiyar hokar uh, after getting ready that's right after getting ready oh after getting ready to yeah. the office okay after getting ready which is taiyar hokar and the sentence in which form is it written main office jaungi future indefinite the indefinite yeah okay. then what does it mean mai office jaungi so i'll go to the office after getting ready see awesome i'll go to the office after getting ready i think you said it the other way around first so the key yeah. is to break it down okay <laughs> the key is to break it down okay so mai taiyar hokar office jaungi awesome um uh what about you tisa ji you want to tell us a, a sentence um क्लास पढ़कर और क्लास जाकर आफ्टर गोइंग टू द क्लास आई विल बाय द स्वीट लेट्स से मैं मैं क्लास जाकर मिठाई What do you want to say? Khareedungi. Ah, kar khareeda and khareedungi. Khareedungi. Okay. So khareedna is to buy. Okay. Yeah. Khareedungi. Okay. Me class jaane ke baad aur me class jaakar bazaar jaungi. Let me make it a simple. Me class. Me class finish karke aur class jaakar market. जाऊंगी लेट मी मेक इट बिट सिंपल ऑसम ऑसम ग्रेट नवनीत यू नो ट्राई पाठशाला जाकर मैं कहा जाकर साइंस पढ़ूंगी मैं 
जाकर ओह स्कूल जाकर ओके पाठशाला जाकर स्कूल जाकर साइंस ओके पढ़ूंगा और पढ़ता हूँ ओके सो इफ यू से पढ़ता हूँ वट डज इट मीन रेगुलर बेसिस So that's that's a slight distinction. Good job there. Okay. Um, so let's say what our friends are saying on Facebook. Okay. So Shirin is saying, "I exam karke certification uh, lungi." Okay. "I will eat the drug and sleep." Great. Um, awesome. Um, I and Caroline are saying, "I will eat the drug and sleep." Okay. Great. Um, awesome. Um, I and Caroline are saying, "I will eat the drug and sleep." Okay. Great. Um, awesome. Um, I and Caroline are um so the question is jaakar i want the meaning okay so i think shreen already answered after going 